Hello everybody and welcome to Copper State Golden Retrievers and this is the introduction to the puppy video and this will be the first video that we do kind of introducing you to all of the puppies and this puppy right here is the blue boy and you can tell that by the little blue collar that he wears right now it's just yarn but as he gets bigger we'll replace it with a blue collar he was the first one born, and he was born at about 9 o'clock in the morning. He was just about a pound when he was born, and now he is up to just over 2.5 pounds in the last 10 days. So he's growing really nice and big. He's probably the, one of the biggest puppies right now. Him and, oh, I forget which one, but they like to battle for... He gets to be the biggest of the day, and as you can see, he's already really enjoying the attention and affection that we give him. So, I can't think of anything else to tell you about this guy right now other than to just let you look at him. Right? Is that the plan? Just let you look? None of their eyes are open yet, but they should be opening here in the next day or two. We're expecting them to start peeking open and looking at things anytime now. So, this is blue, and I'm going to be going to the white puppy next. Who is the next one born? Okay, here we have the white puppy. The white puppy was the second one born, and he was born at about 9.30, and he was just under a pound. <laughs> he was 15 ounces when he was born, and he is up to just over two and a half pounds as well. So pretty much just like the first one, blue, Again, obviously I'm calling him a he, so he's a boy. And as you can see, all of their pigment has come in. If you looked at the first couple of videos, you saw that their pads of their feet and their noses were pink when they were born. But now they've gone to their nice black color. And they got their fingernails trimmed today. Oh, I found a spot. I found a spot. Can you see that? <laughs> so remember, if you're playing with white, he's got a spot right there. So, <laughs> sorry little guy. So they're all just got done eating, which makes a great time to do this video because they're all tired. And not quite as rambunctious. But as soon as they open their eyes they're going to really want to explore the world around them so the next time we do this video they will probably be definitely playing with some toys and running around and that kind of thing here we go Oop. there you go hi hi oh crash <laughs> he's pretty tired you gonna get up for a minute and look yeah? Oh. He's wondering if he can eat my hand, but oh, now he's going to take the rub. Yeah, you're going to take the rub, huh? Alright, so this is the white puppy. And next, uh, I think it's black, but I'm not 100% sure, so we'll both be surprised here in a minute. Alright, next we have black. Black was the next one born, I was right. He was born at about 11.20 in the morning. And he was 15 ounces, so just under that pound again. And now he is just shy of two and a half pounds as of last night. So, 
two pounds and five ounces. So, oh, do you have a spot too? <laughs> so as you can see, they're already getting very used to being loved on. And we do this throughout the course of the day. My kids do it, my wife does it, I do it. Just to give them that interaction with people and good experiences. Yeah, good experiences. I'll get my big meat hand out of the way there. So, let's see. Black is one of my youngest son's favorites because he got to pick the color black. They all get to take turns. We have lots of different color yarn. And so black was what he wanted. So you can see they're all pretty much the same color. Um, as they get older, their color will change a little bit. They say the color of the ears at eight weeks old is the color that they're going to be as an adult. But he's got really good, strong pigment. Huh. Yeah. And I know you guys are all jealous right now, wishing that you could give puppies loving. And you will get to, soon enough. Huh. Huh. Yeah. So this is the black boy. And I think we've got one more boy before we start going into girls. So we will see you in just a minute. Okay. I was wrong. This is our first girl. This is Mint, and she was about 14 ounces when she was born, so not quite a pound. Oh, big yawn. And now she is just over two pounds, so her weight gain has been really good too. I think she's the biggest of the three girls right now, but a lot can change in the next couple weeks. So as you can see, she likes her loving. Huh. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna go down to sleep, huh? You're gonna go down to sleep. So, sleeping like this and eating is pretty much how they spend the first few weeks of their life until their eyes are open and their ears are open and they start to explore the world around them. So, this is completely normal. I'm going to come up just for a minute. People want to see you. Oh, so, oh, there we go. Oh, another big yawn. So, anyway, we love to give these little puppies lots of love and rubs on the head. We also play a lot with their feet so that they get, oh, you're going to give me your paw. What a good puppy. What a good puppy. We play with their feet like this so they get used to having their feet played with. And I trimmed their nails this morning, but this just kind of helps with that whole process. A lot of times you'll have a dog that are afraid to get its nails trimmed, but by the time they leave here, they are used to getting manhandled in just about every way possible. So we go through, the can't talk, I'm sorry. We go through routine of making sure we rub their paws flip them on their backs, flip them on their sides, and just get them used to the, just everything. You got a scratch? You got a scratch? So anyway, this is the mint girl, and the mint color is very, very light, so it'll be hard to tell if you're looking at the video. I'll try to give a color sample of it for you there. So it almost looks like white, but there's just a tint of green to it. Yeah, big stretch. All right, let's see who's next. Oh, I forgot to tell you, she was born, I think I forgot to tell you, she was born at about 11.28 in the morning. Okay, next is another girl. This is the purple girl. Come here, purple. Here you go. She right now is the smallest of the puppies. She was about 11 ounces when she was born. 
and now she is might hit two pounds today but probably will still be just under two pounds Come here. so she doesn't quite have the big potato belly that the other ones have but she is gaining a lot of good weight every day you see the camera let's bring you back so you can be in focus a little bit there we go so oh. <laughs> as you can see very into getting the rub yeah so my kids will sit there and I'll sit there and give them a rub every single day and at first they weren't sure quite what to think of it but now they like it so they've grown used to this and we are just practicing for you huh come on let's back you up oh So again, eyes not quite open yet, but you can start to see that bigger, darker spot right where the eye is. That means that they're just starting to crack their eyes open. They can't see anything yet, but another couple days they should be opening up those wide, eyes nice and wide. Come here. you a close up of that eye. There you go. So that is the purple girl. Alright, here we have another girl. This is the pink girl. She was born at about 12.30 in the afternoon. She was about 11 ounces when she was born. And she's made some really good gains the last couple of days and is just over two pounds now. Come here, sweetie. There you go. Oh, big yawn. Big yawn, huh? So, let's see. I think what else to tell you about her? She's a sweetie. They're all sweet right now and unfortunately there is not a lot of difference between all of them right now and when I say unfortunately that's actually a good thing you want them to be consistent but just enough of their personality hasn't been exposed to tell you which one's active and which one's not you know and we'll learn that over the next six weeks but right now like I said that all they do is eat and sleep and sometimes wine. Huh. Sometimes wine. Oh. Trying to get her to be still so the camera can focus in on everything. Sorry about that glare. Get my hand out of the way here. So, as you can tell, there's her pink little collar. And so this is the pink girl. All right. Whoop. <laughs> Next we have red. Red's a bit spunky. Oh. Just because he can do more stuff right now. He was born at about two o'clock in the afternoon. Just under a pound when he was born, and now he's about two and a half. And. 
he has a little bit more motor function now than some of his litter mates but they will all catch up with him shortly you can see how he's trying to push himself up oh, oh. and part of that is just to get a better rub You gonna show everyone how big you are? Woo! <laughs> Come here. Come here. Show everyone. And in just a couple days on the webcam, you're gonna see them all doing this, where they all start, they wanna get up on all fours, and then can't quite do it and fall down. And then they will try again. Huh. Huh. Whoop. Crash. You gonna do it? Oh, those back legs are just barely sliding out. Want some help? I can help you. Oh. <laughs> they, they, they walk around like little little drunks when they're just starting to learn but believe with me I think this one will be the first one walking huh and I inadvertently just made him about half of your favorites <laughs> but I promise you they'll all be doing this here in about another day oh are you going to get up oh no nope, not quite yet okay well here is red, and I will be bringing out green last. Oh, All right, we'll go get green. All right, this is the last one, and this one is the green boy. And he was born at about 3.20 in the afternoon. And he was about 13 ounces when he was born and is now just about two and a half pounds. So he is gaining weight really, really well. Huh. Again, all love to have their little ears rubbed and their faces rubbed this early. And their paws. Pretty much everything. And we're just very, very gentle. And we make sure that we're always doing everything in a reassuring way but we do like to stress them out just a little bit so they get used to it so every now and then we'll do something that they're not expecting just to let them know that it's okay and they'll recover from it and be just fine try to get that glare away from the camera for you so that you can see him a little bit better there we go so as I said they're all sleeping right now they just ate and they sleep for about two or three hours between feedings right now and mom just will go in there and wake them all up and nudge them with their nose and clean them up and say it's time to eat and then they all eat and she's done she leaves and they all fall back asleep and that is pretty much their day right now. Huh. Did I find a spot for you too? Oh, I did. I found a spot for you too, huh? <laughs> so, anyway, these are the puppies um, from this litter. And I hope you've enjoyed our little introductory video. I'm sure that um, as they get older our videos will become a lot less of me talking and a lot more of just watching them play but I thought this was a good opportunity to kind of introduce you to each one and tell you a little bit about them at least as much as I could for now and I hope you enjoyed it and we look forward to sharing the next six weeks with you